squares. Traits, jeans, hundred squares. Got the eyelids and they come in pairs. Traits, jeans, hundred squares. Got the eyelids and they come in pairs. Let me teach you about the jeans and traits, how they pass on to generations. It's great, we got hundred squares to figure it out. The inheritance of traits, we'll shout it out. They're the key to understanding genetics. It's as easy as can be. From dominant to recessive, we can see how traits are inherited. It's a guarantee. Dominant genes are the ones in charge. They show up every time. They are large, but recessive genes. They're hiding in the back. They need two copies to show up. It's a fact. So let's fill up the square to predict the fate. Use a punnet square to determine the traits. Capital letter for a trait that's dominant. Phenotype is what's observable or prominent. Punny squares, they're the key to understanding genetics as easy as can be. From dominant to recessive, we can see how traits are inherited, it's a guarantee. Punny squares, they're the key to understanding genetics as easy as can be. From dominant to recessive, we can see how traits are inherited, it's a guarantee. So now you know. The basics of inheritance It's all about genes It's no coincidence So let's use Punnett squares to figure it out The science of genetics is what it's all about Trace squares, genes, they're the squares To understand the genetics and it's how yes compared From traits, dominant genes, recessive Punnett squares How traits are inherited, it's a guarantee Punnett squares, genes, they're the squares To understand the genetics and it's how yes compared from dominant to recessive, we need to square. How traits are inherited, it comes again, pairs.